Welcome back to another episode on Beho Reviews on Gaming and Entertainment. In this episode, we take a look at Season 2 of one of my favorite animated television series on Netflix, Glitch Techs. If you're not familiar, take a look at my review from Season 1, as I love the show immensely. Spanning one more episode with 10 episodes this season, the series brings back its great comedic writing, introducing new real-life parodies besides gaming with more character development. Even the Remembrance episode, where many TV series show old clips to remind you of the past episodes, is done so incredibly well. Can you make it poppy? With the purpose being the same as High Five and Miko taking down glitches found around the city like the Men in Black instead of being newbies, they are considered very talented members of the team. Along the way, they delve deeper into their personal history, bringing more life than just looking at a fantastic show done well. You will look into friendship, teamwork, personal sorrow, redemption, and especially family. I loved how the team accepts all members for who they are as each get to know each one another better and better. I found that although meant to be a kid's show, many adults will understand its meaning for kids as a positive way of treating others as we look deeper and deeper into each character, especially Mitch. Introducing new characters with established team already can be dangerous, but they devoted strong episodes to the Dabney Glitch team and Ridley. I loved how the interactions between one another didn't consume the season, but they are there for future episodes. You will see that gaming is not the only thing that the Glitch team needs to solve. Looking at parodies from the likes of real life Chuck E. Cheese and modders to even retro gaming, these looks make the series grow rather than stay on a similar path, but a safe path. I loved how the series expands, especially introducing new and old themes not to be forgotten. I love how the writers honor the history of gaming and others. Best part of Season 2 is that there is an actual cliffhanger to push the storyline and lore of the season. Season 1 didn't have one making you hope for another season. Having a bigger look at what's to come makes you want to watch even more awaiting Season 3. The animation is top notch, equaling or enhancing it from Season 1. The action and storytelling is right on par and the pacing is excellent. Only con is that I wanted to see more episodes. Watching 22 to 25 minutes in a 10 episodes is just not enough. Glitch Tech Season 2 gets a 9.0 out of 10 for its excellent writing, action, character development with excellent animation and storytelling. That's it for me on this episode on Beho Reviews. Please like and subscribe if you like my videos. Beho out and Greg, take us out of here. No, you don't get to say something and just walk away this time. You walk around like you're heavy. But really, you're just a selfish punk who's too afraid to work with us instead of against us. Dang! <laughs> Please. This is Glitch Tex, not Mitch Tex. We're a team, so if you're not willing to be a team player, then we're better off without you. Damn. <laughs>